Hey guys, welcome back to the second video in uh, the series the World, in the World of Warships videos that I'm making currently. I uh, decided this time we're going to go. Uh, we're going to take the uh, Bismarck out for a little spin, and uh, yeah, it was a good game. We'll uh, see what kind of mischief we can get up to in this little baby. I've uh, obviously gone for. If anyone who's playing World of Warships currently knows, Germans, German battleships, it's all about the secondary build, as far as I'm concerned. That's the uh, the playstyle that I'm going for in this. Still working on this ship currently. I think I've got a 14 point captain on this, and uh, yeah, focus mainly on secondaries. We're on the Tears of the Desert. We've spawned on the south, southeast side of the map, and uh, yeah, I think uh, as our flank, we're going to head up to capture the sea point objective, and um, see if we can't do some damage to some uh, enemy ships. Just have a quick look on their team. The teams were fairly evenly matched. Yeah, looking at it. Five battleships apiece, two destroyers apiece, the rest cruisers. So, as always, guys, I hope you really enjoy the video. I'll try not to talk too much through it all. Um, but, yeah, I appreciate any comments, feedback, uh, things you'd like to see a bit more of, things you'd like to hear a little bit less of. Um, we will be playing some other games um, at some point. I have got um, World of Warships footage sort of ready, um, so probably the first few videos will be uh, some footage of this, um, and then we'll move, we'll diversify, do a little bit of uh, gameplay on other games, and uh, just see see how you guys like it. Uh, I'd like the channel to be. Um, to do to well play games things that you guys want to be seeing um obviously not always what I'm uh, expecting to play so it'll get me out of my comfort zone play some different games so I'm lining up this uh to go here he's showing me a nice broadside so we'll see if we can punish that and there we go straight away citadel 12,000 damage he's uh He's not going to last long sitting in the middle of the map, broadside to uh, everyone over here. He's obviously realised his mistake. But uh, for some reason, he's, well, he's had to turn for the torpedoes and uh, he's shown me another broadside, so we're, I'm going to have another go at punishing that. And uh, yeah, another Citadel, first blood. And uh, we've got our first kill on the board. So still pushing up to uh, up to C point. We've captured it. Our friendly Benson here has laid us a nice little smoke screen, which we'll uh, try and take advantage of. Enemy Bismarck is moving in. We've got an Amalgi heading in, and here we go. The secondaries have already started on the Iowa. I sort of want to be just heading for this smoke screen really, just to give me a little bit of cover. I'm obviously detected um, by aeroplane. So one of these guys over here has already got a spotting aircraft up. There comes the Don score, I'll see if I can do a little bit of damage to it. Uh, that could have been better. So now I'm not detected anymore. I've dropped inside the smoke screen, which is something they're working away from on the next patch, from what I've read. Um, I've not played the next patch as of today. It is out today. Um, so we'll just have to have a look and see how that works out. Uh, but from what I can gather, it is to stop people doing this. They're just sitting in 
to destroy a smoke, but I've come through the smoke now, the smoke's dissipating. I'm trying to angle as best I can with the amount of ships that are here without doing exactly what this guy here was doing and just sitting broadside onto everybody. Not terrible damage. But we'll uh, see if we can get some more damage on these cars. Yeah, I was obviously backing up here. Try and get to uh, try and get some shots on to me. Terrible dispersion. Do three thousand. Not too bad. I think we're getting some more fires on these guys, really. And the Don score is down. I'm just noticing now we're starting to take some fire. Yeah, that rapid fire. I think can only be monitor is hiding behind the the islands over there. So I've spotted the torpedo and just backing up. Just to try and avoid these as best we can. Enemy hipper there, show me a nice broadside, see if we can punish that. Unfortunately not. Dispersion not helping me at all. But my secondaries are still working the Bismarck over. They're doing some consistent damage. And the damage counters are there going off. That enemy monitor is starting to become a bit of an annoyance now. Over the hill there. And this enemy hipper looks like he's heading down towards us. Again, another cruiser with broadside wide open to all of these ships. And, uh, yeah, he's lucky, he just turned in time just to minimise the damage that we might have been able to do to him. Still 3,400. We'll take that. Here comes the monitor fire again. It's not quite as accurate as you probably hope it would be. He is firing from a reasonable way away. Let's see if we can do a bit more damage to this guy. No, unfortunately. He's been taken out by the torpedoes. Oh no, the North Carolina took him out. Very good. So just the Bismarck left over here. The Amargi's still heading this way. Well, I'll take 6,900 any day. Here comes the monitor for that, and that's the Bismarck down. So the Amargi's just totally run out of friends over this side of the map. And uh, we can start pushing now. Obviously, this monitor fire is uh, becoming more and more accurate. Looks to be armor piercing fire. I don't expect him to be firing uh, high explosive on me to try and get some fires. So I'm angling to, you know, I'm angling against the Amar here. I'm not really paying as much attention to the monitor at this point. His eye seems to be very. Miss, miss, and hit and miss. Really, he's not getting consistent damage on me. So, so we can't do a bit more damage to some army. Uh, not too bad. I'll take, I'll take that damage. Do we light a fire or two on him? In the secondary fire. He's decided he's turning around and he's, uh, he's going to head back. Make turret critically 
And now my secondaries have started to light the Minotaur, so I've got both sides of the ship firing now. He's, uh, he's taking some damage as well by looks. We've got a gun down. At the moment. So just got to wait for that to come back online. Yeah, we're slow. We're getting it. We're getting there. We're working him down. And there we go. The monitor's torpedoes. And that Amalgi, he's done. So now I'll turn my attention now to the monitor. He's the next target for me. He's my closest threat. Try and recover some of my health. Can't lob a shell over the island, so I'm just going to head towards him. He looks like he's going to stick his nose, but one of the friendlies has taken him out. North Carolina's got him. So I think now we better head for B point and try and capture that the enemy team down to three, three ships now. So we're looking good. Although they've got the A and B captured, they uh, they're down three ships on us. We've got the French cruiser down there. We've got the Alabama, who's uh, running alongside him. So my focus now is going to be on these guys and where the uh, second battleship is. We need to uh, spot him. So we've got B point, we're going to capture that, that shouldn't be a problem. That looks to be, on the minimap, the other battleship is down to the south of B. Just waiting for this guy just to stop turning and see where he ends up. I'm now detected, it's not getting well. Some shells on him. See whether we can get anything. And, yeah. Shocking aiming, really. Very poor. And then my attention then turns to the Bismarck here on nearly full health. It looks to me like he's probably going to take some torpedoes off our uh, friendly destroyer. Let's see if I can lob some shells over the uh, top of the cliffs here onto the Alabama. Yeah. We've got a hit, which is better than the last salvo. And then my focus then is is on the Bismarck. Um, I know these guys are beyond the islands, they're out of reach of me now, so I need to try and get some damage onto this guy. And he's uh, burning nicely. I always put the fire out, so that's his damage control used. So if he takes one of these torpedoes which it looks like he's going to, he's going to have some flooding. And obviously here goes the hail of uh, secondary fire from both of us. And he takes another torpedo. And his health is just melting away at this point. So I was still a little bit worried at this point that I might not be able to get the job done. But with him using his damage control, we know that his health is just going to disappear in quite a quick fashion. He's got a fire, he's obviously flooding. And yeah, that will take that. Just finished him off. The enemy Benson had already uh, done most of the damage to him. But yeah, we're not doing too bad, 122,000 damage. I'll just uh, say good game guys on the uh, chat, it, uh, it was a good game for us. I know a lot of people are opposed to this map, I, I, I think you either have a really good game on this map or you have a really bad game on this map, it tends to be a little bit mixed, it just depends on the team lineup and 
the quality of the players on your team and on the enemy team. But obviously, when we all on the uh, eastern flank, we pushed C. Most of us stayed together, and then uh, moved into B. Um, well, that worked out well for us. This guy's at the limit of my uh, range on these guns, but I think well, it's got to be worth a pot shot, and obviously he turns, so we're never going to hit him in a month of Sundays. And now he's, he's just trying to survive now, as, as long as he can. Um, I mean, the game, the game's over now. Points-wise, ship-wise, he's not going to come back from. Uh, on this. Look at that dispersion. It's absolutely terrible. The only thing with the German battleships and dispersion is absolutely shocking. Some shells could be landing in a different postcode to other ship shells. Helps if you get them on target, man. But... I was hoping I might just get the kill shot, but meh. Not to worry. But yeah, we've got another solid, solid game. I was happy with that one. We've got some decent credit, decent XP. So, hope you enjoyed that one, and uh, obviously comment, like the video, and uh, subscribe if you did, and I'll uh, see you guys in the next one.